All right, so we are back with some more Farming Simulator 2013. We have got our hay all baled. Old Mac Geo is back with us. Hey, guys. And we've got um, $97,000 again. Where I left off, I think I had around 1300 after purchasing the loader, the forks, the bay, tra bay trailer, jeez, <laughs> <laughs> the hay trailer, and our baling machine. So we've got all the equipment now. We've got all the, the hay bale sitting in our field over there. We've sold, let me show them, let's see. Our uh, silos are pretty much all completely drained. We sold everything because apparently, I don't know if it's true or not, but I guess if you leave the stuff in there long enough, it'll spoil. I don't know. Yeah, just don't know how long that takes. Yeah, we don't know the how long that takes. So we figured we might as well sell it because we've had that barley in there for quite a while in the corn and everything else. So we cleaned our silos out, sold everything. We've got just enough now to purchase our... A cruising auto stack FS sixty three dash seventy two. All right, so I just went ahead and purchased that. I got seventeen hundred dollars to my name. I feel feel rich. Okay, so I just reset it. Let's take a look at this. There it is. Holy hell! Are we gonna have a tractor <laughs> big enough to pull this thing? The green one may be able to pull it. Look at the size of that thing. Yeah, it's big. I know. <laughs> Holy cow, man. There's no way. <laughs> Only one we find out. All right. Well, old Mac Geo's getting in it. Wow, this thing is wicked looking. Let me take a look at this. So I'm, I'm assuming this, it, this device of it here drops down. <laughs> and and the, white, it, the little white piece. Yeah. This part looks like it drops off to the side because it's got a tire there. And then it feeds them all to the back back here. Yep, stacks them all for you. Looks like it's got a big conveyor system here. So I'm assuming we're going to have to drive this ourselves as well. Yep. Oh, nice. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Do you have a weight on it just in case or no? Yep. Yeah, yeah, put one on it. All right, let me run over there with you. Actually, I just jumped into the... Yep, yeah, bail somewhere. Where are they? All right, so let me see. I'm going to try and run alongside you. That way I oh, can see. I want to see the machine Whoa, in action there. All right, so is there any, like, is there options to turn on certain things in it? Or, like, how yeah. does this? Yeah, it's not on right now. Okay, so you just hit a button there. Yeah, and now it's ready to pick up. So now that little conveyor system activates there. So now it's ready to pick up a bale. So you have to perfectly drive and line that up. That doesn't have to be perfectly lined up. Oh, oh, let me catch up. <laughs> there we go. My gut doesn't run as fast as your... Uh, I want to see this thing, like... Okay, so you slow, you drive right over this. Oh, wow. Stacks, stacks, stacks them for you. Oh, that is freaking cool. One down. Okay. <laughs> run along. Yeah, the next one. Catch up to you. There we go. So it scoops up the next one. Spits it in. Whoa. <laughs> That's freaking awesome. Yeah, <laughs> makes things a whole lot easier. Yeah, it does. That whole freaking loader thing, man, is for the birds. Wow, you could just speed around and do that, huh? Yeah, I told you you can go full speed. It'll still pick them up. <laughs> oh, nice. You can't pick another one up till it's done. Oh, moving. gotcha. All right, let me jump in there and grab. After you grab one more bale to stack it. Oh, yep. okay. Yep. That's good too. <laughs> Okay, turn on all my lights. So let's see, transporting position. Is that what I need to hit? Yeah, everything should be set up still. Transporting just locks it all up. Oh, gotcha. So now it's spinning, so now I just gotta do this thing. Wow, that is freaking cool. Mm -hmm. Easier than. That forklift. <laughs> oh man, that screw that forklift, man. That <laughs> thing is, that thing is like is gonna give me nightmares. Yeah, that thing just it takes so long. There you go. See, so everything's gonna finish moving back there before you pick oh, another one up. Gotcha, gotcha. So now from this piece though. I'm wondering, dang, this thing is just so cool. 
just the, the advanced technology in real life that this stuff is real, that they make this stuff after, you know? Mm -hmm. I didn't realize this equipment was real. I never thought to look either, but... <laughs> <laughs> Oops. I'm off there. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's stuck on my wheel. There we go, I there got you go. it. <laughs> so now... Oh wow, I thought it was getting heavy. Um, I just wonder how we sell these now that they're all getting put on the trailer. Like if we have to off step. Whoa, the trailer looked like it was ready to tip over. Almost full. Yep, it's getting there. Okay, 14, 16, two more you can carry. I've got about another six bales out here. This machine is like like the best equipment I've seen so far in this game. Yep, you're full. That's it? Should be, should be 18. 2, 4, 6, 18, 12, 14. Yep, you're eight, you're full. Alright, so now... I don't know how we sell these things though, because now I have unload bales, which is my O button. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that, that's, that's gonna. That's what unloads them in the back and stacks them all up. So I wonder if I can just back into this trip to the barn here. Uh, it's gonna, it's gonna stack them straight up, and it's gonna be taller than that doorway is. But I wonder if it'll sell them because it puts them by the door. Maybe we can push them in with the loader. We'll back it up to it and I'll see. I'm gonna bowl into them with the tracker if that didn't work. back into it here and see if I can sell them just by backing it in. Okay, we're at $1,700 right now. Okay, so backing into it does not do it. Okay, so now let's get to about, is about right there good as far as... This whole trailer's going to raise up. Oh, so I should have pulled forward more? Oh, yeah. Alright, here, I'll let you do it. I want to actually show them what it looks like when it's doing its thing. You might want to back up. Yeah, you, have enough, you might have enough room now. Okay. Alright, let's see this bad boy in action. Yep, I was raising him up. Have enough room? There we go. Oh, wow. That is pretty cool. Can you back him up now and push him in? Let's see it. if it sells. Oh, right about there. Stop. Yeah. There. Perfect. I'm going right there. Oh, crap. They're all, like, balancing. <laughs> that is freaking... Wow, look at all the parts moving around. Is it, like, nerdy to get all excited over a baby <laughs> machine? <laughs> I told you how sweet this little machine was. <laughs> wow. That was worth a hundred grand right there. Mm -hmm. So Not now... All right, so now I'm wondering if maybe we should jump in that, uh... Are you just going to push him in with that? <laughs> Try to. <laughs> <laughs> it worked. Yeah. I put one in. <laughs> All right, well. Let me go jump in the loader then. Oh, yeah, we're breaking in the money. Look at that. <laughs> What, six left? I'll see if I can push it with the loader like this. Oh yeah, look at that. I knew those loader would come in handy. Hmm. Look at that. Yeah, that's all of them. Wow. Yeah, we got 14 grand now from 1,000. So that was that's like just extra money that we were throwing away just by plowing the grounds. Not too shabby. I'll take it. I'll park it over here in the barn. Since we're not going to use it that much, but it'll be worth using. Mm -hmm. Maybe try the missions later when they pop up. Oh yeah, speaking of that, we'll do the missions next time around. But for now, what we'll do is we'll take our fancy machine and we'll park it over there. <laughs> and then uh, we'll go get our cedars going on that other field real quick. Man, this machine is freaking awesome. We're going to plant that, that big field with weed again. <laughs> Just for this machine. <laughs> the big one? Yep. I guess I better get the tractor then. Let's 
see how good I can get this thing backed into this. There we go. Crank it, crank it, crank it. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that, man. I'm professional. Professional. Get my weight back on this thing. Grab our uh, sewing machines. This game just gets cooler and cooler every episode. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice when you have money to buy all the good stuff. Yeah, it does. Right now we're pretty broke though. Again. Yeah, again. I'll go to the far corner and go away for or towards the, towards the farm or towards the barn house. If you want to start at that corner and go towards me, I guess. And then I'll just put it on the higher, and then we'll let the farmers do their thing. Right, he's gone. Back him up. Oh, we're planting wheat. Did you plant it wheat? Yep. Okay. And there we go. And they're off. So after these guys are done seeding, we'll come back, we'll fertilize this field, and then uh, we should be good to go. So let me get the harvester ready to start harvesting this field here when this starts popping up. Because I've already got these ones seeded. Yep. Got and that ready. One by the end is already seeded too, so that's taken care of too. Yeah, the one up here, yep, I've got this one seeded and, and fertilized as well, so we're we're good to go on this aspect. Let me get this trailer hitched up and good to go. I just like getting all the stuff prepared, that way when they start popping up and we're ready to rock and roll. There, that. Just like this. I think we are. There's a loader. There's this cedar. There's that cedar. Yep, I think we are uh, officially ready to let these guys do their thing on their seating. Yep. And uh, yeah, so basically this was going to be just a short video, but I just mainly wanted to show you guys that bailing technology on that new uh, trailer. Because you guys are probably, if you're watching this video, you watched the previous video of me trying to manhandle that fork front <laughs> loader. That was, oh man, we still got bales out here. We got to come get the Did cedars are pushing them around. Oh shoot! <laughs> well, let's see if the forklift can carry that big thing. Yeah, we got bales. The cedar guys are pushing the baler or the little hay bales around out here. I thought we got all of them. No, remember we were full and there was like six or five of, five or six of them left. Uh, I forgot about them. Yeah, let's see if that front end loader will even tow that thing. Hey, don't scratch my new equipment. <laughs> That's 200 and something grand there. Uh, well, I won't carry it. Won't? Nope. Oh, we're screwed. So we gotta wait. This is when we need a third tractor. We have a third tractor just sitting over there. Oh, way on the other side? Yeah, that's not worth bringing it all the way over here. What all right, we well. Do while we'll wait for crops. <laughs> yep, yep, we'll wait for crops. We won't make you guys wait for that. Like I said, I just wanted to make a quick video to show you guys the baling technology. We've got our new baler here. It's pretty cool. It's an extra income that's well worth it instead of just getting rid of all of the, the hay on the ground. Plus, on top of that, um, we can run it up to our cattle. Once we figure out exactly how. Yeah, we have to buy another machine. Um, the feeding technology machine right here. And you feed the hay bales into it and it shreds it into straw that you can put mm -hmm. in your shed for your, your animals. You've got the the Coon Primor 3570, yeah. then you've got the 20, next one. 20 grand. You, yep, and then you've got this 136. That looks like a Hoover vacuum with a glass case on the side. Yep. <laughs> Yeah, those are the fancy ones, but I think the next, I don't know what we should buy next. I'm not sure what this, have you seen this header trailer under miscellaneous? It's like a transport thing, so you can park tractors or equipment on it, and you can use it to to transport, 
Um, the, it says it allows you to transport the cutters of your harvesters in an efficient manner that suits traffic conditions. It's <laughs> not that much traffic in here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's for the grass. That's for the lawnmowers and stuff, which we don't even own. Exactly, yeah. So I'm wondering. Um, I'm thinking maybe what we probably should start focusing on maybe on our next episode is either buying some more fields, like maybe that one by the inn. Mm -hmm. or maybe start breaking into the potato harvesting equipment, but it's just so expensive. Might need them on the mobile fuel tanks, too, so you can carry it to the other field. That yeah. way we don't have to keep moving that tractor back and forth. Yeah, yeah. So I think we should start breaking into some beet harvesting, upgrading Potatoes. our tippers. <laughs> um, we've got some new cultivators here we're looking at. Plows, we can start connecting some fields together. Mm -hmm. um, and then I'd like to get that bigger sprayer as well. That one would be kind of neat, but there's a lot of stuff in here. We have we haven't even scratched the surface really of this game yet. There's just there's a lot to it. So, but like I said, I just wanted to show you guys the baling technology. I'm very impressed with this machine. It was well worth the 95 grand. Along Told with, you it would be. <laughs> yeah, it was. You weren't kidding there, man. That thing is just the auto stack. Two thousand, thousand, thousand. <laughs> like those monster truck things. <laughs> Definitely well worth a purchase. I mean, you figure. What ninety five thousand dollars for this piece of equipment, and then I spent, um, gosh, how much was the this machine? That thing. Um, this one was a hundred and twenty grand. So I spent ninety five plus another hundred and twenty, and then the front end loader plus the trailer and the fork. So we spent, I don't know what about close to three hundred grand. Mhm. Mm yeah, on all this equipment. But you know what though. I think it's worth it because it's Just, given us, you know. But how much profit did we make just that one trip right there? What's that? How much profit did we make just that one little for the thing for of those bales? hay bales? Yeah. Uh, we got about fourteen thousand dollars, just yeah. in the hay alone. That's not even including the the yield of the farm. Yeah, it's not bad. So that's just fourteen thousand we were throwing mm -hmm. away every time we were plowing it. And we still got like three more bales sitting right here. Exactly, and they're, they're going almost for ready. about <laughs> seven hundred bucks a piece. So that's you know. 2100 bucks just sitting on the machine there waiting for the next time so but yeah so that's what we'll do maybe we'll start breaking into some new stuff on the next round or buy some more farms who knows what we're going to do but for now that's where we're going to end it hope you guys enjoy it old mac geo had a farm e-i-e-i-o yeah. <laughs> even though you're still missing your hat by the way still <laughs> <laughs> yeah your hat flew off somewhere again it's probably mm -hmm. on the field <laughs> all right guys hope you guys enjoyed it and we'll catch you next time later